Hi everyone, my name is Kyle Lyon. I'm a pre-sales engineer here at Solutions PT. In today's episode of Tech Bytes, we're continuing to look into Aviva Insight, which is our cloud-based asset management and data analysis platform. Today, specifically, we're going to be honing in on BI Gateway, which is an optional add-on tool for Insight that extends its capabilities as a data analysis and management platform into the realms of business intelligence. So what we've got and what we've been over is that we've been over how easy it is to get our data from our control systems into Insight and start making actionable content with that. The likes of our column charts, our trends, our graphics, even integrating the likes of uh, supervised machine learning or analytics. But that's great. And Insight prides itself on definitely being you know, self-service. It, it, it's intuitive, it's repeatable. Your content is scalable and it enables easy collaboration and sharing with users across different content types. But what if our power users, say for example, our, our data analysts, our financial analysts, our continuous improvement managers, our energy efficiency managers, the list goes on. What if they want to use the data from the control system that we've started publishing into Insight within their own specialized BI tools that they're used to using and then they, they get additional value out of? What we do with BI Gateway is we consolidate and contextualize data inside Insight for easy consumption by BI tools, the likes of Microsoft Power BI, Tableau, Alpana, and more. And we create multi-dimensional data transformation methods. And what that means is we can shift across our time series data that we're used to in dealing with from our control systems into dimensions that are appropriate for the likes of our BI tools. So switching over to an example here, We've got a dashboard that's used and created with the power of BI Gateway. BI Gateway enables you to set up Star Schema to empower operational intelligence for your team, making use of granular indices about your data and understanding where it is, the context in which it runs, and how that relates to wider business aspects and other data sets. The contextualization comes from Insight to the BI tools so that data is already formatted with the appropriate format, metadata, etc., to be used with those wider data sets. It comes with a built-in model builder and that allows definitions of measures, dimensions, and data sources, three sort of key aspects in generating any kind of any kind of BI analysis tool, to build tailored models for analyzing your data. The easy to use configuration tools help you define concepts like cost, quality, energy, in the case of this dashboard that we've got here. You can also shift it to things like material consumption, and various other metrics from disparate data sources. For BI Gateway to then transform that data and compute those metrics into the BI tool of your choice. So going through this dashboard here as an example, we're monitoring energy efficiency. So we can see we've got a nice chart here that breaks down across locations and lines how much energy is being used. So immediately we can see that Baltimore is using quite a substantial amount of energy just from this chart at the bottom left here. And we can see this, at, this reflected in the other two charts on this dashboard as well. We've got a GIS view where we can see that we're actually judging our energy consumption total by the size of our circle. Again, Baltimore being the larger. And we can see the same information on a standard line chart trend. Where this really becomes powerful is when you combine it with other data sets that already exist, and you use that to understand some more contextualized uh, problems for your business. So take this chart, for example, here. Here we can see that we've got our four lines that we were just looking at, and we're looking at the work orders on them. The smaller the size of the halo, the smaller the work order. And obviously the larger the, the reverse is true. So what we can see immediately from this chart, just from getting this data into one source and understanding it, is that our smaller work orders running on Barcelona and Baltimore are consuming far more energy. The energy intensity is much higher. Our consumption is much higher than work orders of a similar size rather than the likes of Stockholm and Irvine. 
From this, we can immediately gather that for our small yield work orders, we should be shifting the, that production over to these two sites and keeping the, whereas we keep the larger ones uh, for these two. We can also understand, obviously, that uh, we've got some energy consumption issues here that need to be addressed in terms of, uh, you know, actually understanding what's causing these anomalies. Is there equipment that needs maintenance, things like that. We've also equally got things like histograms, so we can work out things like our quartiles, our interquartile ranges, the various different aggregation functions that we need to understand in this context, the consumption uh, of energy through work orders and products. This is just one example of what Aviva BI Gateway unlocks. The main purpose of it and the, the, the main reason why we see it used is to bring that data that's already been pre-contextualized in Insight, that's come straight from the control system and, and bring it in cohesively with other different data sources and data sets to get a big full picture view across the enterprise. So your main benefits of this is you've got better and even more available use of your valuable operation data. Now it's not just your users who are in Insight who can uh, access it, it's also your users who are already using the likes of BI tools like this, like Power BI, like Tableau. You get contextualized insights combining your industrial process data with your existing business data sets. You get easy deployment of your preferred BI analytics, if you're using those or planning to use those, throughout your enterprise with the ease of bringing in your automated data from your control layer simply. You minimize the need, therefore, for specialized IT resources in building customized reporting solutions for negotiating between you know, the business side and the actual production side. Again, we further bridge the IT OT gap here. We're sharing that critical process information from both sides to arm your business with better, more granular contextual information. Hopefully now you've got an understanding of what BI Gateway is and what it's used for. If you've got any questions or want to get in touch with us to discuss how BI Gateway could help understand your business case, please do feel free to get in touch with us via the references below. Thank you.